everyone welcome back to another video from somos biology in this video i am going to answer one of your doubts and that is how to crack csi net in 6 months if you have 6 months in your hand then what should be your study plan for the 6 month period for the preparation of csi net life sciences you know we make this video every single session before the session starts and every single one of you may watch the video may not watch the video but again come back again to see something more so in today's video i am going to give you something extra something that i haven't Uh, talk earlier so let's start to talk about this idea 6 month preparation strategy for csi net life science examination keeping life science examination in your mind 6 month preparation strategy now we'll make three separate videos from this uh, site one is the 6 month strategy for csi net life science uh, qualification one year strategy for qualifying csi net and one month strategy to crack csi net examination those three strategies will be little different although there will be similarities but i'll tell you who can follow individual of this uh, different strategies and can apply to your study plan so the most important among all these three video is the 6 month preparation strategy for csi net life sciences because that's what csir is guiding us that's what we are following at somos biology we take the classes for the 6 month for our online coaching and we want our students to qualify the csi net examination in this practice of 6 month session and to be honest if you practice properly uh, with devotion of time and everything everything that is told by us an automatic will qualify within the 6 month time frame itself 6 month time is proper for qualifying csi net life science examination while one year is not uh, i mean one year is obviously better than 6 month if you have that much time in your hand you can always go with one year preparation but one month preparation is something that is not for every single person okay so let's go in uh, deep deeper to the 6 month preparation strategy and i have only one sing single sentence for you that is fabulous in depth preparation tests this sentence if you maintain and follow this sentence fabulous in depth preparation and tests then you are going to qualify csi net examination keep every single point in your mind so that you can practice them you can apply them while you prepare so what i mean by this particular sentence this is actually a mnemonic so the way i mean by this is that uh, when i say fabulous what we have here is the f and b both okay so b for basics and f is familiarization so the very first step is familiarization and clearing the basics this is something that is the most important part before attending the csi net examination you need to know what this exam is what are the question papers of the previous years what is what kinds of questions are asked what is the depth of knowledge the questions are asked for okay you need to know the exam every single parts and bolts of this examination very very clearly without that you cannot qualify the exam you need to know the exam very well there are many students contact us all the year round and they don't have any clue about the examination they just join a coaching institute uh, and start to think miraculously they will qualify but that's not the state you join a coaching or don't join a coaching that's your choice but your idea should be very clear about the csi net examination so familiarization of the basics are very important familiarization with the examination is very important so know about the exam know your exam once you know your exam after that you move to the second part that is the basics clear the basics the a b c d s of every single details because you have your time you have your graduation you have your masters you have your time to to understand all the basics from biochemistry cell biology molecular biology zoology botany physiology biochemistry any of the subjects that are out there you have clear your basics right but again you need to understand them very clearly because the csi net questions will be from the basics will be from the very bare minimum basics only okay so you need to have a very clear idea on this and for that we can say that in the 6 month period we can give you one to two first two months for this particular preparation strategy that is uh, familiarization of the basics now basically i'll give you uh, one month basically for the basics uh, if your basics are good to go and if you need more time for basics because not everyone in the same phase in that case obviously you need you may need two months for your basics then comes the second part and the second part is in depth preparation part in depth part okay so this is in depth preparation in depth preparation will be second thing where you will read and learn every single details every single important topics for csi net examination in depth 
in much more detailed manner and that's what you need to read uh, be it, uh, particularly the biochemistry unit 1 uh, unit 2 unit 3 unit uh, 4 let's say unit 5 unit 6 8 10 and 13 i always want my students to at least follow this few units 1 2 3 4 5 6 8 10 and 13 because this is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 uh, 8 9 all together nine units are out there among 13 but still if you prepare this nine units very very well in that that will obviously seal your spot for uh, qualifying say and examination so that is the time when you prepare in depth you should not leave anything behind everything that is under these topics you should read and obviously remember the prerequisite the familiarization with the question paper will tell you will guide you what part of the question is very important what part of a topic is very important and based on that you only read that particular part okay so when you read that particular part remember that's why you need to have a blueprint in your hand a heat map which is a trademark of shomu's biology provide heat map analysis report based on the previous 10 12 question papers of csi net which topics are more important which subtopics are more important which is very very important you need to find it yourself or if you join any coaching institute that's their job to provide you so that is in-depth preparation time and this is something of two months again two more months for that two more months for that so for the basics two months for the in-depth preparation two months if you only need one month for the basics then you can go uh, the in-depth preparation for three months that's your choice now comes the third step and that is uh, the preparation and test so preparation is basically in-depth preparation is done and after that there is a revision 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 and tests so once your basics and in-depth preparations of any topic from all the 13 units of csi net or any 10 units 9 units whatever units you choose are done then you start with the revision and revision is very very important i uh, want you to start revision after four months because it's a total six months course after four months you start revision uh, you start uh, looking at the topics that you've learned earlier uh, in your preparation scheme and start uh, checking them so revision is very very important and along with that you should start practicing question papers and what kind of question papers particularly the previous year's question papers this is the time to practice PYQs previous year's question papers and many of you ask me that uh, which model question you should follow which model question I answer always for the last 10 years that there's no model question to follow in CSI net only follow previous year's question papers that will be enough believe me okay so in that case study from pyqs try to answer question from pyqs check where you lag and fix those go back and read them and come back so at this moment the, the preparation the revision and the pyq solve is going on all at once same so you'll start for the one month preparation time one month preparation time so we have two months done here two months done here and now one month total five months are gone now we have the fourth step and that is the final statement that this is where again for the tests and again for the revision test and revision now in this case test means not only pyqs because i believe you have already solved pyqs in the fifth month so in the sixth month this is a time where you should practice more and more questions and practice means not exactly just like open a book and check the question for the last year and try to solve it uh, for one two minutes and then just uh, check the answer and say oh okay it's fine that answer is due this is what students do right you see a question you see an answer you can correlate them most of the time but it's more important that you st stuck with the question and try to s uh, try to answer it on your own try to find the options and if you cannot find the option properly then at least rank the options that uh, among these four ABCD options, I believe that B is most appropriate, then A, then C, then D, like that. And then check the answer to find out whether your thought process is correct or not. It's very important to get a clear thought process while practicing previous year's question papers. So from test and revision point of view, at this moment, uh, once PYQs are done, here the test means mock test. I believe mock test, where you'll get a real-time test experience, just like attending a text exam 
लाइक दिस एस एंड लाइक सी बी टी मोड फॉर दैट यू मे हैव टू जॉइन एनी कोचिंग इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफर दैट मॉक टेस्ट सीरीज वी ऑल्सो डू ऑफर मॉक टेस्ट सीरीज एंड वी ऑफर दैट एट द एंड टू थ्री मंथ्स ऑफ द प्रिपरेशन पार्ट सो यू कैन चेक योर स्कोर नॉट ओनली कैन प्रैक्टिस द क्वेश्चन पेपर्स बिकॉज बट ऑल्सो अलॉन्ग विद दैट यू नीड टू बी फेमिलियराइज विद द एनवायरमेंट ऑफ द एग्जाम ओके द टाइम टेकिंग एंड ऑल्सो आंसरिंग द क्वेश्चन सिलेक्शन बायस एवरीथिंग यू नीड टू चेक दैट्स वॉट यू नीड टू टेस्ट योर सेल्फ हियर so test is important at the end and also along with that revision obviously you check the test results and you see whether you are good or not whether you are making more negative marking or not based on that you need to revise yourself and basically the revision here is something that you need to do uh, from uh, notes that you prepared during your basics and in depth preparation basically in depth preparation is the time uh, where you should keep notes okay it's very important to keep notes many of you may say like taking notes is time consuming i believe it's totally wrong concept taking note is never time consuming while you make your own notes that is at a, another level of preparation uh, and if i give you a straight ahead note that's another level of preparation i always tell my students we do provide notes in our coaching we do provide books and everything but still i told them that please go through every single lecture and make your own notes and when i say make your own notes it's not likely making paragraphs after paragraphs no paragraph study is prohibited in the first in the last month last one or two months of the csnet preparation no you should not go with the paragraph study because paragraphs will consume more time paragraphs will demand your more time it's not required it's not desired what we want instead is that we want you to write down only important points and from topics and subtopics of the 13 units and just write them down topics that you did not know write them down and every single thing that you need to write it down in your notebook keep tables okay graphs and also flow charts utilize flow charts graphs and tables and everything for your better preparation for a better understanding at this moment so this is very very important for in depth study while you do in depth study this part is very very necessary once that part is done then you can move to the next then you can move to all these things because at this moment once notes are done in the test and revision the final month you can easily revise through those tables because tables are something that you can take a pre print out or just uh, scrap the page and you can stick it somewhere in your house you can clearly see your mind map processes thought processes we are building a mind map series a mind map series for all of you for this upcoming one year of preparation i want all of you to stay with us for this one year of preparation where this mind map series is going to immensely help you for your revision strategies that's our plan is in the upcoming times with cs and it let me know whether the plan is good for you or not in the comment section because i'm going to do that for you and i'm going to make a group where i'll add all the students out there and i'll post those mind maps and also discuss about that which will definitely help you in the preparation so this is something that you should do at the end so this is how this is the four step preparation strategy that i want my students to follow this is the four step strategy basically what we followed when we qualified at that time when because not that much first was there not that many that many you know sources were there so it was very easy for us to focus on only any particular thing only one or two things but now there are so many uh, things there are so many uh, videos that are popping out there are so many uh, coaching institutes that are coming out so it becomes very difficult for a student to choose like the the selection process is always immense that i choose this or that one or two three or four so it's very very important that you should have a very clear picture in your mind a very crystal clear clarity in your mind that you need to qualify you have to qualify this exam what is the reason you have to qualify for this exam why you started preparation in the first place and everything so that you can continue in that direction and follow this particular strategy patterns for cracking cs and exam in 6 months follow these strategies and you can easily crack cs and life science exam in 6 months so that is the best 6 month preparation strategy for cs and life sciences i believe you have a clear idea about this you can take a screenshot for that if you want to and if you like this video please hit the like button share this video with your friends and colleagues and subscribe to this channel to get more videos like that because i have two more videos there you can watch that uh cs and it preparation strategy for one year cs and it preparation strategy for one month and also let me know whether the idea of uh, the mind map series is important and to build the group and adding you in the group and continue with the mind map series is important for you or not thank you everyone bye